Yo, what's going on you guys? Welcome to a brand new video on SAO Fatal Bullet. My name is Biz SG and hope you guys are having a super wonderful day. Super glad to see you guys back here. Sorry for the lack of uploads lately. I've been super busy trying to help my main channel called Vince SG and the link is in the description. So in this video, we're going to be talking about the quote unquote jack of all trades uh, stat set. So you know how when you change your status numbers and you get strength, dexterity, agility and all that. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you my jack of all trades build set which lets you use like most of the relevant skills like all the ones that I think are good so let's get right into this build set and uh yeah So before I get into the actual build, I just want to give you a few words. This is by no means a min-max build. And if you don't know what min-max build means, you just Google it and because it's a whole thing. But if you know what it means, this is by no way, shape, or form a min-max build for your character and SAO Fatal Bullet. But what it is, is a build that will pretty much allow you to use any of the most relevant skills to their level 3. And by relevant, I mean skills that are relevant to me. Ha, joking. No, but seriously, the skills that I use seem to me... To be the best ones in the game for multiple reasons like leveling up for grinding for grinding uh, the skills to get them to their highest proficiency or to you know fight certain monsters you know i like to change up my skills in certain weapon sets based upon the situation i might be facing and not have to worry about changing my stat points around every single time because oh now i'm fighting a giant type enemy oh there are 90 of these ads around, so I have to use this stat point setup and so on and so forth. Now, I'm not saying that doing that is bad, changing your stat points every single time, because it's most certainly all a part of the game and all a part of the fun of the game. But I know there has to be people out there that are just like me that would benefit from knowing the numbers on their stats. Now, the only thing I regret about this stat build is there's one skill that I can't get with this build, and it's called Graviton Shot 3, which requires more dexterity than I had to spare, though Graviton Shot 2 works just as good as 3 on most enemies. Actually, I haven't seen anything that Graviton Shot 2 in the game on Extreme Mode doesn't work on. So Graviton Shot 3 is definitely the better skill, but Graviton Shot 2 will most definitely work just as good. Alright, so let's get into this build thing. Okay, so as you can see, I have a level of 128, and that gives me 8,850 CP to divide into my skills. If you don't have this amount, that's okay. Watch this video to the end and see what skill stats will be more beneficial to you. Strength goes to 116 solely because you need 116 to use Power Form 3, which raises your damage output so you can knock things out faster and cover the strength you may need to use certain weapons. High Strength is also good for Photon Sword damage. Vitality, Vit is good at 97, and that's basically to get Armor Form 3, though I'd feel more comfortable if Vit could be my highest stat because it controls your HP hit points. But for the purposes of this stat build, 97 is perfect. Intelligence at 118, so you can get one of, if not the best skill in the game, Electrodynamic Stunner 3. At all costs, do not go into battle with any type of projectile weapon with at without at least Electrodynamic Stunner 2. Electrodynamic Stunner 3 is a lot better though because everything is put down, you know, with stun buildup with Electrodynamic Stunner 3. Agility, AGI goes to 118 also for the best sword skill hands down in the game, Horizontal Square 3. This sword skill does a lot of damage to a wide area and is great for farming large groups with your sword. Just make sure you have something to reduce cooldown. And again, if you have a, a large, a high amount of strength, this sword skill, Horizontal Square 3, will do a lot of work. Dex goes to 74, though this is the one that lets me down because of Graviton Shot 3. Though at 74, Graviton Shot 2 is still a good skill. For Graviton Shot 3, you will need 128 in the Dex. Graviton Shot 3 is a heavy weapon launcher skill that works a lot like Electrodynamic Stunner, but it affects a wide area with stun buildup. Alright, at luck, and luck we're going to have 30 for your healing field shot 3, which is arguably the most valuable skill in the game. Now, if you do build your stats like this when you are able to, uh, you should have no problem getting all of the skills in stage 3 that are useful with the exception of Graviton shot 3. Now, for your officer's build, I mean, I'll just show you what I did for her. I, basically... The main things that I did for my office's build, I really didn't go into a whole, a whole lot of detail with this. I wanted her to have high vit. I wanted her to have uh, high intelligence, high luck, 
and everything else could you know be distributed out evenly of course i want her strength to be pretty good so she can use most weapons but for my officer's unit i don't really use her for attack i use her for support and tanking so that's why i like her to have a high vit so she doesn't die too fast and i like to have her with a lot of luck and a lot of intelligence so basically she can use all of the healing skills because that's pretty much what i use her for heal me and take the attention off of me though there are other npc characters that you can use for the tanking like basalt joe he is really really good for the tanking all right so a little bit i'm going to show you exactly all the skills that i got here in super fast mode so you can see all the skills that i definitely want to get with this build and maybe you can see if these are some of the skills that you like now, if this video was able to help you out with your build set, do me a huge, huge favor and let me know that down in the comments and also hit that thumbs up button. And if you have any improvements to this build set, like if you can see a way to min max, a way to, you know, OD your launcher set, definitely let me know that skill build set down in the bottom as far as agility, this number, strength, this number, this, that, and the third. If you understand what I'm saying, because I definitely want to hear and see what you guys are doing and maybe give me your reasons behind that, you know, because they do give you a a certain amount of slots to save these builds and i haven't really done that and literally going to your room and saving your build set it's not that hard you do want to keep one build set blank at zero though so you can always go to it and change something for the better all right so i'm going to leave you now thank you guys so much for watching and once again i'm super sorry for the lack of uploads i've been trying to help my first channel with all this dragon ball content if you guys are fans of dragon ball definitely head over to my first channel venice sgn and the link is in the description and also it's somewhere on my actual channel page if you guys use computers anymore most of you guys probably only use phones and that's cool all right so thank you guys again once again so much for watching i hope you guys have a great rest of your day and thank you so much for checking out this sao video and again i urge you and i'm not just saying this please type your builds down below what you use to fight maybe certain groups certain enemies farming certain things because i know there is probably an easier way to farm this boss to get this type of weapon and make it just easier on everybody and also i know people are talking about pvp builds listen i have not really touched pvp too much in this game but i know some of you have let me know your pvp builds specifically i'm looking for pvp sword builds because swords are literally overpowered in pvp all right thank you guys so much and i'll see you next time peace out Papapurei, para porera, para porera, para porera, papapurei, papapurei.